Hello everybody, welcome back to EU4, Paradox Game of Playing. And uh, it's Japan time. We do have some forts. It's level 6, level 6, level 6. They kind of like level 6 forts. Um, let's see. It's actually my king on here. I want my king to die. Okay. It's time to... Move these guys over here. Go to the Tokai Sea. And we got another revolt. We will take care of that. It's another heavy coming out. Uh, we have started colonizing Palu. New mission, Conga Wanju. Where's that? No, I don't want to conquer one, dude. Okay. There's a 25 stag there. Let's see if they will attack me in Yamato. They haven't moved at all. back and get some more dudes. get them to land as well. We can go speed forward because this is there's nothing happening. They just don't want to fight me. Aki has fallen. Move to Harima. Yeah, just keep keep moving troops. That means we can actually move here. And take that province. Only 12 war score. I need capital Kyoto, so that will take a while. Harima has fallen. Let's take the castle. Ava. All right, so just move these guys across. Okay. Small naval battle ensued. And they're not moving because I have some other navy somewhere half across the world coming in. Yeah, I do. You know what? Go away. Then what? Okay, now they'll move. <laughs> Stupid mechanic. Yeah, we'll sail from the White Sea to Japan. How much money am I losing here? 
2.3 right, Let's get rid of some more forts then We lost the cardinal before and then we gain another one. So merge these guys up. There's only plus one from artillery. I only have six. And I need eight for plus two bonus. Why can't I click this province? There we go. And here I have 14. So I could get two. I need to to, cha to transfer two artillery to the other group to max out what we have. Can you go there? In fact, can you go all the way there? Yeah. lose legitimacy well he will probably die soon so that's fine he is leading this siege here all right we got the extra artillery that should take us to plus two yeah plus two these are suffering from the minus two so we should probably split up the navy here 10 on each side and then I even have two more to go here and one to go here took care of Yamato. Uh, let's take out his uh, army here. Without a general, but that should be okay. Farmlands. Yep, no problem. And that's another level 6. So we get the two. Oh, Tsuchima has fallen. Let's just take uh, one poor guy back and grab that province right there. And then head to Kyoto. That was quick. Kyoto has fallen. Okay, let's check out the peace deal. So just to be uh, sure here, the three provinces I want is Ryukyu, or Okinawa, and then Chikosen here, and Setsu, those three. So, with that in mind, let's fabricate a peace deal, where I take this one, these three, these two and Setsu. So I have a line in this way. And he's actually willing to do that right now. Thirty-seven war vibrations and your money. Yep. Let's just uh, end it right now then. We 
we get exactly what we want and we need to call that up and I think for the Japanese islands I'm gonna go ahead and raise autonomy on everything I just want um, as few rebels out here as possible there we go take these guys back to Tosa meet up with the Navy and these guys will go in here That did give us 75% uh, or extension, so we need to uh, get rid of that before we go any further. Even Austria is here <laughs> with one stack. Thank you very much, Austria. All right, that was the Japanese islands. And uh, we are now making 20, so we can go back and this guy and get rid of this castle nice that leaves just Southeast Asia now all right Portugal got cloth here I'm very pleased with that. Tito got fish. I don't know yet what I have. And then we have one, two, three, four, five provinces left. Where China where I can spawn. Plus my own here, that's six. But that doesn't count. Uh, we need another conversion going. Right, so next target will, will be Bengal. I just need to burn off my my coring. And of course Japan is going to westernize off of me now. But I don't think they will attack me. Next revolt is here. Get our king on there and boom. Alright, so next of all will be Hui and Ning. Let's just check where they will spawn in the White Shove. That's over here. Get these guys over there. And in Shukwan. That's that one. Get the turtle on. There we go. Now oh, there it is. Uh, get the general on here then. There we go. And just put the general back on here. Okay. Alright, we should get in position because coring will be quick. Uh, well, these guys are taking attrition here, there's no reason to do that. And just get them over here. Rain in Palu, okay. So no China wear there. Now we gotta get ready for Bengal. Let's leave one army in the north and move the others down. This guy can move as well. And I guess I can make more armies too. 
although my manpower still needs recovering. Uh, I think it's faster if you go there. New Pope. And go pick up guys from there. Bring these guys down. Bengal is still fighting Congo, France, or they're already fighting France. No, I'm gonna hit them anyway. Just gotta get the troops ready. Coring is already 50%, so that's not gonna be an issue. So we'll leave 41 in Japan just in case. We also got Mongol separatists. Where are they gonna spawn? In Ningxia, 13.8. Where is that? Ningxia. I got Ningwu. Oh, the names, the names. Oh, I couldn't see that. Okay, just go there with these guys then. Okay, so take the fleet down to here. I move this army over here. So I have roughly 160,000 or so troops in the area. Check if anybody's landing colonies here. Well, Chidora's taking this one. So that leaves only one, two, three, four. Four possible candidates left. Now we got the anticipated rebel uprising right there. And then we have the Lang Sang in Luang Prabang, which is here. We already have troops present. Get these guys. No, just let them stay there, actually. <clears throat> and get the journal on here. We have to fight Dive yet as well. Let's check the fort situation. There are forts all over the place. Uh, his capital, though, is all the way over here okay all right so let's check if we attack him uh, who's gonna join everybody Portugal Diviet and Delhi Delhi might be able to get through here though but I have vassal armies all over the place so that's okay And coring is 73%. So let's hit it. Uh, it's a, I don't like this imperialism though. Uh, hmm. It takes a long time to get to the war goal because of all the forts. So I won't get ticking war score. I think what I'll do is I'll just pop in a claim because I only want a few provinces from them including 
Sukhothai. So let's put a claim on Sukhothai. And just wait for that. It's uh, just going to be easier that way. So any new missions? <clears throat> Reduce our extension. We are do we are doing that. So might as well grab that mission. Uh, let's keep converting. I have a lot I need to convert. And only one missionary. It doesn't matter. Just convert it slowly. Oh yeah. I guess we could put the laser diplomats to... No. I already have uh, everybody liking me there. What about Bamanis? Let's make Bamanis like me. And even make an alliance with them. I will do that just before we attack. First we improve relations. Because that way they won't get any aggressive expansion either. There we go. Positive relations. And the Japanese revolters. Right, let's just put the general back on here and hit them. That will delay the coring uh, slightly. And th that one we anticipate it too. Natural decline. Alright, so come back and stand in Setsu. And the core should come in now. And the others in just a bit. And the claim is almost in. There we go, we got the claim. And the last core is about to finish too. So what we're gonna do is declare on Bengal, take what we need, and then it's only Pasai, Sunda, and Tidor left after that. That's gonna be in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you again soon. Bye bye.